hello everyone in this video we will see the concept of currying in Scala so let me write a code then we will discuss this concept so we have just created a singleton object and in this object we are defining our main method so now what we are going to do is we are going to define a simple function then we will see how this function will be changed if we apply this concept of query so we are going to take a add function this function is going to take two parameter of integer data type and the return type will be integer so what we are going to do here we are going to use this notation okay so this is a very simple function this function will take two parameters and it will return the addition of these two numbers and here we are testing our function whether it's working or not so we are passing here two parameter now let's see the execution so we will compile this program scala c and the file name okay so uh, showing one error this error because of this symbol now compile it again So it's compiled successfully now run it so it's successfully executed now we will see uh, if we apply currying what is the concept of currying uh, this uh, concept says that if a function is having multiple parameter so this concept convert that function uh, into a form which will take only a single parameter now the question is that if a function is ta taking let's say two parameter so our this function is taking two parameter and if we convert this function into a form in which that function is going to take only single parameter so what will happen with second parameter so uh, here comes the concept of currying so how this concept is applied whenever we convert a function into the form which will take only single parameter so the return data type of that function will be a closure function a function which will take the remaining parameter so we are going to apply here the same concept so we are converting our this function into a function so uh, we know that this add function will take two parameter but we are converting it into a form so this function will need only a single parameter but uh, what will happen with the second parameter so here we will write our closure function so uh, it says that uh, so here uh, the return data type of this will be this function sorry uh, we will take it b and we will make it a plus b so what actually will happen uh, now this uh, calling syntax will not work in order to call it we have to use this notation so now how it's working uh, we have called a function with single parameter so it will make a call to this function now this function is having a return data type of this one it means it it is returning a a function an anonymous function and that anonymous function need only a single parameter so the second parameter will be given to this anonymous function and finally it will return a plus b so let's see the compilation and the execution so uh, it's compiled and so now we are getting the correct result so the current concept is that we are converting a fun multiple parameter function into a function which will take a single parameter and the return data type for that function will be a anonymous function which is going to take the 
remaining parameter. Thank you very much for watching.